Let's talk loading options, guys. Uh, there's often some confusion as to what do I need with what I'm doing, what are my loading options. So we'll provide some clarity on what our options are and what we recommend uh, based on what you're doing. Entry level is your seven foot slide out ramps. This one here is a heavy duty ramps. This is perfect for guys primarily doing hot shot or maybe it is a bumper pull deck over like this. Primarily used for hot shot loading freight on and off the sides. But once in a while you want to load equipment or it's mostly narrow tire equipment. You don't want to be loading wide track heavy machinery up here. This one specifically is your standard I-beam trailer. So the deck height is higher, which is not optimal for loading heavy equipment. So these ramps are great. If you're loading equipment once in a while and it's not wide track equipment. Moving up from there is the most popular option, the BT-7 Conquer ramp. Full width, perfect for wide track machine. When they flip over, you got your full 10 foot of loading angle. Cleated, so track machine, wheel machine, all work great. Dual hinge, or dual spring hinge system, so it's easy up, easy down. You have a few options here. When they're flipped over on the deck, you still have a full flat deck. If you're hauling freight, you don't lose out on that deck space. Or if you're hauling a longer piece of equipment where you need your full deck, you can lock them up in the vertical position and you don't lose out on deck space. Moving up from there, essentially the same as the BT-7, same purpose as the BT-7. This is the BT-6, the hydraulic dovetail. Uh, we see guys that are doing lots of loading day in, day out. Hotshot guys that are hauling equipment, they're loading multiple times a day. This is the way to go. Bites a little more into the budget. Uh, as far as ease of use and the amount of times you're loading in a day, it's kind of a no-brainer. This is the option for you. Uh, it's a push-push of a button. You can load 10,000 pounds on here. Haul 6,000 pounds is what we say. Obviously evenly distributed, but, but, but sit and load easy 10,000 pounds on here. So there's no messing around with ramps, no flipping up and down. You drive on, drive off at the push of a button. And lastly is the gooseneck full tilt. This one here, we can see it's upfitted for container hauling. But it doesn't have to be. We do have lots of guys that haul this for equipment, for freight. Um, they want the versatility of being able to haul containers, haul up dead equipment, winch up dead equipment, still haul freight. So it has a multi-purpose, biggest loading option there is, uh, depending on what you're doing with your business. So for some guys, they definitely don't need this sort of investment. But depending on what your business is, if you're doing a few things, this may be something you want to consider is the gooseneck full tilt.